why the first two chapters of my book really tell about my my story as a teenager really because now looking at everything from hindsight i was this typical you know bullied fat kid uh from those hollywood movies where you have those you know sexy girls and the popular football playing guys and then those geeks and nerds so i was that typical geek and nerd the only way for me to talk to a girl was when i was giving her my homework from maths um that couple of years of being bullied in in high school really built this internal need to uh, to have to prove to everyone around me that I am worth something because I had huge was the word you know self assessment problems you know what i mean uh, self esteem yeah self esteem problems which then turned to be an uh, extremely powerful tool in business uh because if you're really motivated to prove everyone around you the business rewards you you have a you have a personality issue that is rewarded if it gets deeper yeah because you make money just by showing off in in financial sectors you know i was in this in this whole subculture of investment brokers financial advisors insurance agents it was all about who's going to you know buy a new car and a more expensive suit so it was all that external validation which was in short term very powerful success tool but it can destroy you in the long term um so unless you know how to channel that energy and even till today which was proven with the whole interpol case and and the nigeria corruption case is that the harder it gets the more i have this internal i call it the positive irritation or the positive positive enrage positive rage that is not really uh, the it's a positive rage that gives me really energy and focus to uh, to operate and defend and do something because there's also this type of a rage uh, that kind of makes you chaotic and you don't do anything you just kind of burn yourself inside but i have this thing that the worse it gets that the more survival instinct i have i actually have more problems to motivate myself when everything goes okay when i kind of reach the you know security level the satisfaction level this is doing great you know i just got myself a new bike or whatever and everything is great and i'm like okay now what now i feel now i feel demotivated and i want to lie and watch netflix for a day so i guess it just works the other way yeah